Well, I first met Abel back at the Royal Northern College of Music in Manchester. He was a couple of years below me. I could tell then that this was someone incredibly talented, passionate, and also someone very driven. So it's unsurprising to have him here today. This is very outside the orchestra's kind of normal repertoire, but it's, it's been such a collaborative experience and a lot of Abel's pieces are kind of evolving as we rehearse them as well. So things change last minute, if it sounds more percussive, more rhythmic, as rhythm is like the real core and driving force of so much of his music. So it's been really explorative. It's been great as well to kind of allow ourselves as classical musicians to kind of get into the groove a bit more. I met Seku in Senegal. I was very, very lucky back in 2009 to be invited out by the Belfast School of Music who were taking a group of musicians out to study West African drumming, djembe, seeing his masterful education and sharing all the stories and sharing all the different dances from the local area. So we got a real insight into the flavor of Senegalese culture. I find this week really exciting. Uh, the rehearsals have been full of a real positive, happy energy. The guys that have come in, there are super soloists. We've got Seku, we've got another master percussionist, Siddiqui, playing djembe and calabash. And then, of course, what a wonderful cellist we have in Abel, sitting out front, leading the show. So the rehearsals have been fantastic, just full of energy, full of joy, full of smiles and just great African grooves that we're all trying to find our way around and having great fun just getting the style and just getting that energy because that's what this music's all about, real high energy.